kupiga na kutuharibia mali yetu wameharibu vitu zetu wametunyang'anya masimu wametuumiza ile kabisa sasa mimi nataka kusema hivi hii serikali ya Kenya kwanza ndio tulipigania I'm one of the chief campaign campaigners of Kenya Kwanza government I'm among the very first people that started selling and campaigning for his excellency William Ruto truly I wasn't campaigning to be repaid like this I wasn't campaigning for land grabbers to come and start claiming that our church properties are their properties. We cannot lose properties in this country. No, ni wengi. Wamekuja wanasema ni NIS, wengine wanasema ni DCIO, wengine ni police, ni wengi. So definitely government is involved and it, it is sad, very sad that this is the government that we campaigned for. I'm yet to believe that they can do this to me. I'm the one who sold Kenya Kwanza, UDA, in Nairobi County. I'm the one who gave them a platform. Leave alone that. I'm the one who gave them a vision for Nairobi. And today, look at what we are suffering. Ukingia ukundani kumejaa polisi and they are all armed. Wametunanganya vitu zetu, wametukua simu, wametupiga. Me, I have to go to hospital. Sayi nimekunywa peinikila, sindio nifike hapa. So I go, have to rush to hospital. It is sad. It is very, very sad. Very sad. Bila mna zemanga nini kwa serikali kuna mungu biguni ata kwa tu kama kanisa kuna mungu biguni if anybody in Kenya kwanza government can dare touch my properties, je na wale la yawe ni hawana mtu wakua saidia? Wale la yawe ni hawana mnyewe? If Jesus is alive, ministries is under attack today. How about the common one inchi? Tutahamia wapi? Tutahenda wapi? Serikali yetu ya nyewe ndio inatupiga. Where are we going to go? Where are we going to run? Mimi mwenyewe ni mesalimia watu wa DCIO hapa ni kawambia karibuni mutu wakole. Kumbe, they are coming to reinforce their NIS brothers. Alafu wakaitata wengine. So you can really see, tumefika place where is. Sisi ndio watuna mutu wakutu saidia na mahali ya kuchimilia. Lakini, kuna mungu pinguni. Wacha tuone. Kuna mwadeka njuhu. Wamebomoa huko nyuma kuna ukuta wanabomoa huko hata saa hii waimesimamiwa wanabomoa wamebomoa wagomea huko na walikuwa wamekuja tena tarehe 10 mwezi wa February wakaanza kubomoa from hapa from the start sasa na sisi tulikuwa na harusi kanisa ilikuwa imejaa watu the wall that you are mentioning the pengine bishop is it the same wall that you moved to yes it is the... it is the same wall and it is the same wall that they had the money actually demolished my wall to put their wall. So now they are coming to demolish again. And it is because the court case is coming up, so they are trying to protect themselves. Ati wajafunga jia. Unajua jaji ya kuja kuona ameru nini. So they are coming out, they are trying to cover up themselves. Which one to one? Ata bikuni kuna sheria. Wacha duniani. Ata bikuni kuna sheria. Hey guys, I have to go to, I have to go to, to hospital. Mweshimua mwago is here with us. So, mekuja hapa leo. Uh, he attacked me happen up uh, I've been a member of this church from Alikom Protokdok and there have never been any land issue. So, to to find out the truth. These guys have come invaded this place. I want any court order, I want nothing. any eviction. They have nothing. nothing. They're just claiming they are under from orders from above. And it is good that they have admitted there is a force behind it. MD Mainga is a person that Office yake kwa hapa, less than 200 meters. Ni mtu mwenye na jobisho kwa very long time. Alikuwa nafaa kuja hapa tuambie, kinaganaga tuambie. But you can see there is another force enye konyuma, enye natakula kugrabisha mba enye kwa hapa. And there is nothing short of that. Kwa sabu wezi ingia kwa shamba ya mtu bila ene, na hii kuna case ya di kotini. Even the respect for the rule of law, it is lacking in this administration. Hini ilo serikari enye sisi tulisema, mtu na matokeo yake, and you can see what they are doing. If you're pressing even their biggest campaigners, you can only imagine yes. what they are doing with us, with the taxes sir. and everything. Sir. Anu watu wenye wana uruma na sisi. Yes, na sisi tunasema hivi. Kama mtu wamefika mahali mpaka na grab shamba ya kanisa, uyo, that's not a human being. And we are going to deal with them, kwa sabi Kenya pia inatawalio na sheria. Yes. Na wezi tuambia, there's nobody above the law. We are not going to take this lying down, we are going to take, get to the bottom of this matter. 
Kwa sababu tukubali hii na sasa wale wanyonge. Eh wale hawana mtu wa eh, Hii kanisa nyinyi wote mnajua imekuwa hapa kwa miaka mingi sana. Kama zaidi wameanza kuinvade hapa. Na sasa wakianza kutafuta wale watu wengine. Sisi hatutakubali. You could maybe elaborate and make it clear. Is the church on leave? Is it no, on no, no. rent? No, 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 no. What is the church? We have our title deeds, my dear. This is our property we bought. We have title deeds. We have no debt. We own no man. That property is ours. This is property is ours. We even have a approvals yes. to build a twin tower. Yes. From the county government, from all the... the, the our properties the are even under construction yeah. as it is. You can see this is under construction. Yes. We are building a twin tower that is going to... So it's something that we may approve by all state agencies. So, I am going to grab the chamber. I am going to go to the court. 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 I am going to go Atero ni watiri kari atau kampai ni dia untuk kau nak bertanya untuk kau terasa biasa sih itu ni orang ni rata tuhnya itu sih itu ni orang rata tuhnya beroti sih itu for real kau nak dengar tak ya kau dengar kau itu orang yang mana kau nak itu ni kau ini ada ni wakai ni aku nak ceria katika ini so let us fight it out legally kau nak beli orang nasema kata tuan dia apa property area ni gani apa kau nak property area ni berugal ini Barukale ni ya ni ya investors wenye wamejinunulia property zao. What is the next move? Have they given you a verdict? Have they come in? No, have they, they, they have not said anything. No, they have not said anything. They have actually pushed us by beating us. Because when we are mufu, I have to go to hospital. They've broken our legs. They've broken our hands. They've taken our phones. They've taken our money. They've taken our car keys. Even as it is, I have to look for somebody to take me to hospital. They've even taken our car keys. Were you given notice? No, no notice, no court order, nothing, absolutely nothing. Ile ukora proper ya land grabbing. Lakini mesimamua na nani? Na maaskari. So you can imagine.